Hello, and welcome to 8-Bit Stuff Showcase, where we showcase the products and new things that we have at 8bitstuff.com. This time, we're going to talk about the floppy EMU 3.5. This is it. This is a floppy emulator that comes with the form and function of uh, the same the same form as a floppy 3.5, an external floppy drive. So this floppy emu is basically a case that was designed around the original 3.5 um, drive. So what does it do? How does it look? How does it work? So again, it looks like um, a new version of the floppy 3.5. It has, um, you know, the feet, the same look and feel. It's 3D printed very nicely. It looks like a real product. So, uh, or, or well, it is a real product, but looks like a produced product. And it's really 3D printed and is made by hand in the USA. Anyway, uh, what do we have? We have two versions of this, and also we're going to sell a kit. Now, the kit, again, I've been putting on, on the site, is not very recommended for everybody. It is complicated to put together. It involves soldering. Uh, it involves a lot of little things that you got to do. So it's not for everybody. I recommend to buy the, the final product, and I got two versions of it. I got the version that has that uses a cable like this, an original Apple II cable, or cables that I have created. Uh, unfortunately, the, the connectors are scarce, so they're going to be difficult to get. So uh, when I get them and I put them together, I put them out on the, port, uh, on, on the store. And otherwise, this is an easier one to get, is the one that comes with the flat cable. I'm going to be able to have these ones available pretty easy. So uh, it's the same thing, just uses a flat cable instead of a thick cable. It's just the looks are a little bit different, but if it's in the back and if you got it with a lot of drives, you won't be able to see it too much. Anyway, this is the big difference that you will see from a normal drive. First of all, of course, is the weight. This weights a lot less. It's very, very light. Uh, it, it may be a little bit issue because um, it's so light that, that it doesn't stay there so, so easily. So... Think about that when you put it with your other drives. Otherwise, it's very nice and it looks really good. So uh, you connect it to the external floppy drive uh, for an Apple IIc, Apple IIgs, or if you are gonna use it an Apple IIe, you need a Lyron or um, the floppy um, beam, big mess of wires new card. Um, I forgot the name anyway, uh, or if you, you can also connect it, if you take out that adapter and just put it with a, the 20 pin, you can connect it to a disk, uh, disk two drive um, card. The only problem is that it will only work, of course, like with floppy images. Like uh, it, it won't run any, it won't load any 800K or hard drive images. So anyway, uh, what is, does it do? It's just the, the case. Inside, it's a floppy emulator, and we have a card reader here on the front, so you can pull it out and put in your, your SD card. You push it in, and it stays there. You got four buttons. Select down, select on, up, well, up, select down, and reset. Are the same four buttons that come with the floppy emulator. They're just on the front. And then they have little icons in there just for you to see. And then you got your LEDs or power and uh, in use. So let's see it working. This is connected to an Apple IIc Plus. Let's see how it works. There you go. It turns on. Right now, it's uh, the game Draw is in there. It's reading it. And then when it reads, it loads. You can see it's working perfectly. You can take your joystick and start playing with it and so forth. To use it, you can just reset and it will reset the floppy emu and then you can 
go ahead and select other disk images. They can be was, they can be disk images, or if you want, I just selected slash popular, but if you want, you can also click here and, oops, click here and change the emulation mode. Right now it's in floppy emulation mode. It can be 3.5, oh God, sorry about it. You can change it to be dual 5.5. You can be smart port hard drive. It can be Unidisc. Normally you select the hard drive. That's a good one. Then you do a reset and it will show you all the HD images. I think I got Apple II desktop, yes. And action games, but this action games is for GS. So you cannot use it in, in an Apple II um, plus. C plus. So let's select this and then it can do a reset and it's running out of the smart port and it's running Apple II desktop. And there you go, loading it from the drive. So anyway, that's it. So it's very simple operation. It supports WAS, disk images, hard drive images, 800K images, the floppy emu is amazing and makes a beautiful companion for the Apple IIc Plus, for the Apple II GS, and Apple IIc. It looks like part of the system. You can put it next to, to other drives. In this case, it's okay because this will support it. Um, in the Apple IIc, the color is not exactly the same, but you know, this is platinum, so it's not that bad. So anyway, that's it. This is the floppy emu uh, 3.5. It's available at ABIT stuff. Um, you can order it uh, anytime. Most likely you will see it. Uh, these are the ones that we're gonna have more. And uh, the other version is also available. Uh, you can order it. We can ship anywhere in the world. In fact, there's somebody in France right now doing a video how to work it. So I'm expecting that. So we will ship it anywhere in the world. Go to abitstuff.com. Thank you very much.